this will be the last question for today's Friday Q&A. So welcome to AQ Puncture Super 10 Q&A. Every Friday we do live video. Uh, so if you are not, uh, again, I, I record this uh, for our members and I also this time I'm going to publish in uh, uh, YouTube. And if you haven't joined yet, please down there there's a link. It's just a link. Click it and have a look what's in there, whether it's suitable for you or not. It's very affordable, only $10 a month. And you can ask a lot of questions in Facebook group. And this is the question that my student asked. Okay, let's start with that. UTI. Smelling urine, dark yellow urine. All right. So they normally have burning sensation when they parch urine. All right. They have painful burning sensation and then you can see that dark yellow urine it could be bleeding in there right and some patients they don't have dark urine or smelly urine at all but they have the sign burning sensation painful over here you know they may have the sign too let's quickly go through that normally I go through acupuncture one two three right let me Introduce straight away use OBGYN, right? Magical eight OBGYN. Look at here in. Yang, Yin, Yang. Over here, we have PC, Heart. Over here, uh, Large Intestine, San Jiao. Over here, stomach, GB, okay, then over here, spleen, kidney, this is the OBGYN or magical eight. Now, where do you need those? It's very, very simple. You can just need those because the pain is a lower abdominal and they may have pain on, on over here, this area. Right. So you need them from the wrist down to the fingers, ankle down to the finger, uh, toes. That's it, that's the image. So that's acupuncture two. Acupuncture 3. I just show you. From the wrist down to your fingers. Wrist down to fingers. Ankle down to toes. Ankle down to toes. Okay? Very simple. This strategy cover everything over here. All the meridian. Now, can we do... Is there any other... We can add on. You can. Can this work for STD? What's STD stand for? Can you let me know what STD stand for? I didn't get it, sorry. Oh, sexually transmitted disease. Is it what you mean? Sexually transmitted disease. Yes, if they, I mean, is it what you mean? Okay, cool. <laughs> Thank you, I've got it. If they have the symptoms, yes, you can. I mean, any, any conditions that is related to here, any woman problem, this is good. It's just, they come to acupuncture three, you may have to change the point, okay? 
from here down to your fingers and here down to your toes it treat this part very well okay very well now let me show you another thing based on here if you add on lung liver in here those meridian that I take what are they? magical 8 plus 1 so if you don't lung and liver you are actually combined very powerful <laughs> <laughs> I hope that makes sense to you. Okay, I hope that makes sense to you. Very powerful. Um, that's it. Simple. Quick one. So, I give you the quick and dirty way. Go and treat it. It works very well. Alright. Especially if you just do OBGYN, it works very well. What happened with my patient when they come to the clinic? They go to the toilet, they say, oh, so painful, so painful, right? So I get them, lay down, I needle it, and then after the needle, I said, you have to drink a lot of water, right? Cranberry juice, very good for it. Cranberry juice, it can heal, it can help and heal the damage, stop the bleeding. Right. Very good. Please ask your patient to buy cranberry juice, hundred percent one, and hundred percent juice, and drink it with your treatment. If you know Chinese herbs, we can talk about more. But when we focus on acupuncture, when you needle it, you get your patient. After needle, they go to the toilet. They come out. They say, "Very well. Just a little bit of pain. That's it." They say. Fantastic! There is no pain. Acupuncture is amazing. Happen all the time, all the time. All right. So, this is one strategy. Again, I have other strategy works very well as well, which is pose balancing. If your patient, you need a what? Most of them, they work very well. Some of them say, mm, it's still quite painful. Then next time you want to do pose balancing. Or G acupuncture. G acupuncture work for this method very, very well. Very, very good. With G acupuncture, we do some point all over this part. We figure out yin yang imbalance or sun jiang imbalance. We just needle here. And only few needles. Only few points, not many points. But more stimulation. Just in and out. You don't have to retain a needle in and out. That's it. And the patient go to the toilet and come up. Amazing. Post balancing, not that much needles. Just six needles or two needles, two or six needles with pulse balancing. You check the pulse, you needle it, you check the pulse again, at the pulse, it was there, and it come to balance, you know it's working. We just leave it there for 15 minutes. And then remove the needle, get the patient go to the toilet, amazing. Then what do you do? Chinese herbs. According to that, we give the Chinese herbs. Right. If we six needles, we put six herbs. Two needles, we do two, two herbs. That's it. Very simple. Right. So that's it for today, and very happy to share with you. Um, if you have any question, please uh, go to um, any further question. Please go to um, uh, Facebook group and ask. Um, 
I put it down, put the question down there, and next Friday we will answer you. And if you are not member yet, and you watch this video and you want to join, the link is down there. Click and have a look. Search on and see the value of it. This value, thousands dollars, but we only ask for ten dollars. Very very affordable. And Monday ten dollar. Okay. So go and click the link down there and see what we can do for you. Thank you. Bye-bye.